story, if you have to describe Chinese films in three words, what would it be? Realistic, sincere, um, and well done. If you could choose one of the landscapes in China that you could feature it in your film, what would you choose and why? In general, in the, in the places, uh, places of the Jajanka film, the world also. Uh, but uh, location is not really important for me. I mean, uh, you can make it work uh, everywhere. There is always a gold, golden spot where you can put your camera. If you could choose any Chinese directors to work with, which one would you choose? Jia Zhangke. Of course. I think you have a lot of common you guys. I think he changed my uh, vision of China. If you could go back in time and tell your younger self a piece of advice, what would you say? Be cool. <laughs> Be cool. Yeah, I mean, uh, I wouldn't ex exaggerate something. Would you give him some encouragement? Uh, I still need it, actually. Uh, you always need some encouragement in making films. But uh, maybe uh, I don't care that much now. I see. So, do you have any unique habits while you're filming on set? No. Really. <laughs> I'm a boring person, so uh, the set is the place I hate a lot. You have to rush all the time and I'm always nervous, so it creates a kind of anxiety. Yeah, I totally understand. If one of your films could be adapted to another kind of art forms, like a painting or a piece of music, which films will you choose and how would you adapt it? I would adapt Winter Sleep mm -hmm. because it's very suitable for theater, I think. It would be a good play, I think. Which literary works have you recently read that you want to recommend to us? I am still with the Russian classics because I am reading. I was reading a lot when I was very young, uh, since maybe 16 years old. So sometimes I feel that life is imitating art. Do you have anything, any specific approach to filmmaking or storytelling style that you want to explore in the future? In my last works, last three works especially, I. Uh, experienced and wanted to try a lot of dialogue. Maybe I, I want to leave it now. It's enough. Uh, it was an experience and uh, for me. And you're gonna leave more silence in the films? Maybe more. Like my first movies, maybe. And also last question. Will you consider using AI tools in the future when you create uh, more projects? Why not? Why not? Yeah, uh, because Sometimes it makes the films cheaper, which is very important. Sometimes more imaginative. If you use it good, I think it's, it helps. It's like a friend, you know. Yeah. I work uh, in the script with others. Uh, I don't know them very well technically, but I want to learn.